Hello guys, in this video I will talk about the adding video to your web pages. The video element has a number of attributes which allow to control video playback. Number first is source. The source attributes specify the path to the video. And the second one is the poster. This attribute allows to specify an image to show when while the video is downloading or until the user tells the video to play. As you see in the YouTube, there are some poster on the images when you play. So until you didn't play, the poster are shown on the video. Then weight and height attributes specify the weight and height of the player in pixel. The control when control when use this attribute to indicate the browser should supply its own control for playback. And autoplay when user this attribute specify the file should play automatically loop when the user this attribute indicate that video should play playing again once it has end so <clears throat> now add multiple video source the source attribute is used to adding multiple video to the video um, your page to specify the location of file to be played you can use the source element inside the video element this should replace the source attribute on the opening tag you can also use multiple source element to specify the video available in, available in different format now let's do it with practical examples so i create a new html document video.html so I open it with my text editor and here I type HTML so video and here I will use in video take video video take close and here I will use the attributes of the source src source equal to and here I have video intro dot mp4 so I save it and open in browser So this video you will see here. So I set it height and width. Width equal to 640 and height equal to 560. Control S to save and open it my browser. So this as you see this is video but here is no control button to control the video so i add a control attribute to control this video controls control s to save and reload your page so you will see here is a control button and here is volume button and full screen button when you click on this so the video will be played and another attribute is autoplay Control S to save when you uh, reload the page, the video will be auto played. Reload the page. Control is to save, reload your page.
so there is some problem so I use an, an another attribute which is the loop so when the video end it will be start again automatically reload your page then So you see as it 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 start again. So now this is the video and you can use it in your HTML document. So another method of using the video is using the source 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 is equal to intro dot mp4 control is to save reload your page so you can also use as so i undo control z and here i will be use a poster poster equal to images slash poster dot jpg control s to save reload your page so there is no poster so i am image image slash poster dot jpg control is to save and reload your page so you will see here is a poster we use it so this is about video in next video i will talk about the idea if you didn't subscribe my channel kindly subscribe my channel and also click on bell icon thanks for watching